since the pandemic started. It's been really busy for us. What I'll do is start up at 6 a.m. We'll deliver a product before we even start our normal day, do a regular day, and then sometimes we'll still have uh, more to do after that. It's a cycle. Truck drivers at the Greater Chicago Food Depository have been in nonstop since March. Normally we'd distribute anywhere between 150,000 to 250,000 pounds of food. We are now during the pandemic up to 300 to 400,000 pounds of food going out of our docks uh, every single day. That means 10 to 12 hour days, six days a week for people like Xavier Hernandez and Larry Jones. But they say the hard work and sacrifice are worth it. A lot of people need food and uh, they, they rely on us, the food bank, to um, put food on the community. You don't realize it until you see it um, firsthand and, and when, you, when you live it. Coming to work every day, you see long, really long lines. And I mean, we're in a pandemic and people are lined up to get food. And for Jones, it's personal. As a kid, we struggled in our household with food insecurity. So I know what it's like not having food in the house. Every situation is different in families, but everybody needs food at the same time. So they'll continue to serve until their help is no longer needed. They are the people behind the scenes, uh, right? They're, they're the ones that do the work uh, that no one gets to see. It's not just a job. It's very important that we do this type of work, and we're going to be here to ensure that the job gets done uh, until we get better, and we will get better. In Archer Heights, Jalen Henderson, ABC7 Eyewitness News. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.